Welcome back. 547 on Daybreak. We're going to head back out to Tokyo or head in here, at least where we're checking in on some of our local Olympians. Matt Anderson, Anita Alvarez, and Brian Err are all there now competing or get ready, getting ready to compete. So we're going to start right now with Matt because just about half an hour ago, he started a live Q&A session on his Instagram stories. So we took the opportunity to ask one. We asked him what he thought about all the watch parties happening here in Western New York. And he wrote us back, including a photo of his mom, Nancy, getting interviewed by one of our channels to photographers and he said grateful for the abundance of people in my life that love and care for me. He also talked about the now infamous cardboard beds. He says that they're not the comfiest but he has slept on worse so that gives us a little more info about those. He says having no fans at the Olympics it's taking away from some of the Olympic experience for sure but still he's having a great time competing with his teammates. We're also keeping track of Anita Alvarez. She has been posting some clips on her Instagram story. The first one showing all the COVID protocols that the athletes have to take in the dining hall. That's her uh, duet partner, Lindy there. She also gave her tour, her followers, a mini tour around the shops at the Olympic Village, which look pretty stocked and like there's a lot of cool stuff to choose from. And then of course, we also want to catch you up on what Brian Err has been up to. USA Karate posted a clip of him practicing to one of their Instagram stories, getting ready for his Kumite competition coming up next next week. Of course, we'll continue to follow all of our athletes and keep you posted every time we see a post from them right here on Daybreak throughout the next week or so. Guys, back over to you. All right. Thanks very much, Lauren.